So in many regions and cultures, mobility is actually the norm, how people manage their livelihoods and also their landscapes. When you think of the Sahel, for instance, pastoralist, transhumant uh, people, they always they, they, they always move with, a, with their livestock, with their animals, because these landscapes are, most of the time, there is a huge variability in terms of uh, resources, in terms of rain. It's an adaptive strategy to climate variability, but it's also a livelihood strategy. That is how people d diversify their livelihoods. When we look at migration, at the studies done on migration, most of them deal actually with the migration from the economic point of view. But there are really, really few studies or few uh, uh, projects dealing with migration and the environmental change, linking migration to the changes to the social and environmental changes happening in the landscape. And this is what we are trying to do in C4, to bring mobility and migration in the center of the debate about changes in landscapes. So, for instance, when we, we think about migration as a, just a passive strategy, people are kind of obliged to move, we see that sometimes, that especially, specifically in the Sahel, this is actually not the case. People are not only reacting to something to migrate. Migration is a diversification of livelihood. This is a strategy and people are doing it actively and as a choice. In one story in Burkina Faso is that we have migrant pastoralist women who moved in a village in, in southern Burkina Faso or in, in the whole region of Burkina Faso in the south. So we have these women who have skills to climb trees while the native women usually they don't. So these pastoralist women normally don't have access to certain trees or to certain uh, seeds of certain trees but then they get this access by exchanging their climbing skills and to get access they are actually paid by by those products and these stories are important because they show us how migration is 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 not always about conflicts migration is sometimes also about having some skills having new skills different skills and using the skills to better manage the landscape Uh, at the JLF, I would like to talk about uh, the project we are doing in Burkina Faso and to bring this kind of migration uh, discourse or migration uh, issue in the center of the debate because we see that migration is always there, but it's seen, as I said before, as an exception, but not as the rule. And what I want or we want in this project is really to understand more how is migration contributing to changes in the landscape? There is also a gender dimension of it because uh, migration is about uh, changing demographies. And we have like villages, for instance, where all young men are gone and we have women and kids in these villages. And we want to understand what does this mean in terms of managing resources, in terms of also gender roles and gender relations, specifically when then people, the returnees are coming back also with a different experience and different skills. And these are the issues I would like to talk about at the JLF.